of Brunette Team Retreat and we're just headed over to have breakfast all together and do some brainstorming and team building and I'm really excited. Can you even believe this view? I picked Tofino as the place for our very first Team Brunette Retreat because I always feel really connected to myself when we're here and it's near the ocean which I think always brings out creativity so we're gonna go to a space that's sitting right on the water and work together and it's gonna be a really awesome day. For me, like my core value as like growing up was always like treat others as you want to be treated. Mm -hmm. And you know, if you like go deeper than that, that is our core values, but that's just like a different way of saying it. And the point of this is really to like expand, you know, we're launching a vision program mm -hmm. and it's like stating our core values, but there's only four. And like, mm -hmm. where do these come from and why are they important? And I think something that's always been important to me and like I think I've always kind of done is making sure that I always give off like an energy or an openness okay. or if they need to talk that they can always come to me. I like to assume the best to people and put myself in their shoes if they're acting a certain way and try and figure out why they're acting that way you know like it's normally it's not coming from a place of like hatred it's yeah. just something within them so I would just like assume the best of people I have always wanted to like put myself in somebody else's shoes kind of understanding where other people are coming from a program I did at another job um, and it's like more of a management program but I think it applies to all life and it's called responsive management and you basically learn that everyone kind of similar to what you said has a different style of learning retaining knowledge receiving feedback motivated um, by different motivating um, and just learning to like get to know people so you can I mean it was a manager program manage them in the way that they want to learn and stuff but I think it just applies to any human interaction <laughs> you have yeah. so just trying to get to know people so you can get through to them that way no matter how sort of differently you see someone's reaction to something, that their emotions are real to them at that time. No matter how like erratic or different, like you're just sort of like that person is being insane about this issue. At that time, to them, their feelings are real. And so just kind of like same putting yourself in their shoes. Whether it's in a friendship, a partner relationship, a work relationship, like I think it's so important to always support people in what they're trying to do or like if you notice somebody around you is having a difficult time, like offer support in whatever way you can. Trying to kind of be more true to myself and standing up for like what I believe in and just being like honest about my own feelings and not just feelings, but just yeah, what you believe in. And I do feel like, yeah, if you're sincere, People will respect that. I think it's important to like not worry so much about what other people think about you. We are on our way to Taco Fino to have burritos for lunch. It's the first truck that they had before they opened any of their restaurants and I think that the burritos here are much better than kind of anywhere. So we're on our way to get them. I'll do the Baja Fish burrito, or the burrito feed. Okay. Yeah. Fashion. Sweet. Yeah. Y'all yeah, look like fashion. <laughs> I can tell. Yeah. Yeah, it's been amazing. Really relaxing. Awesome. And then there's a vegan here. That's a burrito. Mir, how was that? Delish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What kind did you got? I got fish burrito. Mm -hmm. I love how she ties up the um, hoodies. So today we're all dressed up because it's our last night in Tofino and we are going to a lovely dinner at Wolf in the Fog. Sad it's our last night. It is very sad that it's our last night because it's beautiful here. I think I'm ready for pasta round two. <laughs> <laughs> <So>. <laughs> Definitely. Okay guys. Go to the dinner. Let's go. So I make them in sandwiches, so I will get two. And then I guess you need like two or three for this giant thing. Do you like burnt things or yeah. not? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like out of that and then I changed my mind. Partial. You don't wanna go. I really enjoyed hanging out on the beach. Mm -hmm. I had my first s'more last night. And getting to just hang out with everybody. Mm -hmm. It's not often that you get mm -hmm. to spend this much time with the people that you work with. On my 6 a.m. beach walk it was pretty nice. And spending time with everyone. I don't know, I feel like we're closer for sure. We are just on our way home from Tofino. 
we used the rest of yesterday to just relax and spend time together at the beach, but we are gonna, on the ferry, sit down and do a little bit more deep work and write one thing that each member of Team Burnett has done in the office or personally to support you as well. We are gonna write something that inspires us about each of us. So I think it's gonna be a really special experience and that's gonna be the last one and then we are homeward bound. in the city after two days of a really fulfilling wonderful team building experience it was such a great time and I'm super ready to get back to the office and I think everyone's feeling really connected and we had a really really wonderful time mom and dad just <laughs> I know I feel like we're the children <laughs> taking the kids oh my gosh okay so <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's okay. <laughs> you gotta get beach ready. Girl on the move. Choice the beach. Girl on the move. This road sketches me out. I feel like I'm not gonna see something. Like a wolf in the fog. I'd wanna take it home, but I also would be like, well, I mean, that's actually a lie. Smile, everyone. This is your last moment. And what about Frederick? Oh yeah, this guy partied the hardest of all of us, for sure. He like completely went out of control.